I'm excited about this one. Let's talk tech. Guys, welcome back to another episode of Let's Talk Tech. I don't know how many of these I can do because it does cost a lot of money for these stuff. <laughs> but I am excited about this one. Today we got, if you guys seen it on the thumbnail, we got the Bubba Pro Series Scale. Yeah. And I am freaking excited. Let me tell you a little quick story about how I got this. N disclaimer wasn't given to me wasn't sent to me or nothing bought it with my own money funny thing is the day of my birthday june 16th we went out to area 51 i had a, an on tech warehouse it said in stock june 16th so i said i'm gonna be ready refresh 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 all day i was refreshing refreshing you know how it is didn't get nothing right following day still said june 16th restock for these uh, scales. Refresh, refresh, nothing. So I end up um, saying, whatever, I didn't get it. It is what it is, count my losses. A few days ago, I'm online looking at some other baits on Tackle Warehouse. And I'm like, you know what? Let me go to the Bubba scale, see what they updated it to when they're gonna get restocked. July 1st, okay, cool. Later on that day, I went back looking at some more baits. And I said, right, let me check it out. One in stock. I don't know if somebody ordered one. The wife saw how much it was and said, send it back. <laughs> but I ended up jumping on it ASAP, got it, and it's here today. And this is what we're going to talk about. And this is what we're going to get down to. This is what we're going to unbox right now. No wasting, I'm not wasting no time. Receipt. Got it on Tackle Warehouse. Paper. Don't need it. Here it is. Boom. Here it is. Your Bubba Scale Pro Series Scale, fish, Smart Fish Scale, guys. All right, so let's, let me read off the, the front for you guys real quick. I'm excited, man, I'm excited about this. I geek out on this stuff. Real quick, let me, t let me tell you guys, okay? I have, I already have the, uh, I don't know how you guys wanna say it, Rapala, Rapala, you know, the, the touch screen scale that Pretty much almost everybody uses these things. They're, I mean, they're waterproof. They, they work great, okay? I got the Brecknell. I guess that's how you say it. This thing, the most expensive out of the three I'm about to show you, and not waterproof. Pretty accurate, though. And then I got my, this is my um, emergency... Scale goes out. My other little, um, I don't know if, yeah, you guys see it right there. Rapala, Rapala scale. Not bad for emergencies. But now I had to upgrade to this Bubba Pro Series scale. Let me tell you how excited I am. But let's read this off real quick. So you get, you with, with buying this, you get um, $119 value because you, it, comes, it has an app that you can download and connect your scale to. So you'll have a two year for the pro app membership that will be included once you, uh, cause you bought this, which is cool because I think it's like 49 bucks. Um, 60 pound weight limit. It says that it's a uh, accuracy of 0.3%. Uh, calling system. Waterproof IPX7 standard. Uh, let's see what we got here on the side. Let's see. What, everything pretty much says. Let, let's open this sucker up. Let's open this sucker up. Comes with a lithium battery. Let's open this sucker up. I like the packaging already. It shows you uh, log your catches like never before on the app, which I might use it and I might log my catches on there, but definitely not going to make it public. Um, so... 
Live well management up to eight fishes. ProSeer Smart Scale Culling System displays smallest fish and total fish count. Bag weight displays individual and total live well weight. Programmable tournament bag limit. The displays largest to smallest catch. Fish count indicates total numbers of fish caught during your trip. Bag weight displays total weight of all catches. Um, so that was, oh, I could have read it like that. The first one was tournament, rally, and competition mode is compete on one device with up to four anglers. Bag weight displays total weight of each angler catch displays heaviest individual bag weight and fish count. So it was basically how, when I was reading it off, it was tournament, rally, and competition. Those are the three modes that you can actually set it for to, um, to, uh, when you're out there on the water, which I will probably most likely keep mine on a tournament. But slide this, slide this thing out. Look at this case. This case is ridiculous. Look at that case. Nice waterproof case. Metal buckles. Um, I believe it floats. It also floats. Got the bubble logo right there. Man, this thing is solid. Let's open her up. I wish I had a camera from the top view. I'd probably do some overlay on this thing though. When you open it up, it comes with uh, the battery safety thing. Don't need that. We have stickers. Who does not like stickers? The Bubba sticker. We got your Bubba VIP member. Oh, oh crap. I don't know. I think this might be the little code. I don't want to show you guys this. Because I need that for my membership. <laughs> Keep that in there. Then you have your instructional manual right there. Okay. So you got all that. Now, comes with a battery tray for three AA batteries. And um, you can put three AA batteries in there just in case your rechargeable lithium battery um, you just happen to forget to recharge it or you don't you don't pay attention and it dies the cool thing about this Welcome to 2023 USB-C. Okay, maybe iPhone will get into it and start using, using USB-C because they need to get on board But I did also see just recently Tackle warehouse got extras of these so if you want to buy extras That's what I'm probably gonna do is buy one or two extras have them charged up have them in here also pretty cool how they come in here slotted already and then it comes with oh comes with your uh, little poison gel you don't want that throw away comes with the charging cord which everybody should have a USB-C charging cord already and then it comes with this clip right here or A hook which I won't be using the hook I'll be using the clip and there there she is look at her looks like a radar gun but man this thing feels solid this thing feels solid now it says to charge your battery up but let's see how much battery it has so right in front Right there, you would just pop this open. And then you put in your battery. I think there's, it's only one way it could go in. Slide it in, close it, and let's, uh, let's turn her on and let's see. Now I heard, <laughs> before I turn her on, anticipation, I heard that this thing has like the quickest startup time. So I'm gonna press it for like one or two seconds and see how quick this thing turns on. I'm gonna be looking at the camera so I can see. One, two, on, and there we go. Wow, that thing was quick. I hope it's coming out pretty clear for you guys. Um, let me see if you can see right there. Wow, this thing is pretty sick, guys. Um, I'll probably put some overlay, but I'm looking at it right now. The colors, the coal colors, everything is cool. Um, you can 
So, I mean, from what I was seeing on the other people's videos, there's not much out there. This thing is pretty simple, man. Um, you can, so I'm going to go just go through it and see. So I know you hold the right arrow to go to the modes. Okay, there's mode. There's, you got tournament mode. Click on that. You got rally mode and competition mode. Those are all three tournaments. So clear. Then you got erase memory. Don't want to do that. Brightness, medium. Let's see what we can go up to. So you got low. Okay. Medium. And high. That's pretty bright. I'm going to keep it on medium. Bluetooth enabled. I'm not going to turn it on yet. Um, I know it said it did, it did affect your batteries, but I'm not going to turn that on yet. Um, auto lock, uh, I want to enable that so it can auto lock once the weight gets in their batteries. See lithium or alkaline. I'm going to keep it on lithium because I have a lithium battery in there. Sleep time, five minutes. Five minutes sounds good. Keep it on five minutes. Um, units. Have it on pounds and ounces. I guess I'll leave it like that for now. Bag limit. Uh, you could go up to eight for bag limit. Seven, six, five. I'll put it on five though. Uh, factory reset, device info. That's it. So that's pretty simple. And then I think you just hold uh, the clear button and it saves everything. Or it might be the other one. Let me see. Go back to it here. Hold that one so it's clear you hold clear and it um, saves everything keeps it uh, everything that you changed the way it's supposed to be so we can weigh something now one thing that one thing that I was concerned about or wondering is because my coal system don't have a purple and I see purples at number three so let's uh, let's switch it I says five let's switch it to here I'm gonna switch it to let's just do three as a bag limit that way bag limit three okay clear okay now we're gonna save we're gonna save one we're just gonna lock it put it on one save two put it on two now since I don't have a purple it still has these other ones where I can um, put it to so I wonder if I have a green so let's go to green let me see lock now let's not use purple because I don't have purple. So I wonder if I use green, what would happen? Cool. So I could use red, I could use the coal system that I have that I don't have to have a purple. That's awesome. So that way, you know, some people don't, you don't have to be like, oh man, I don't have a purple, so let's just use black for purple. Let's say black is purple or something like that. You, you guys know what I'm saying. So that's cool. So you can actually use your own um, colon system that, but. Bubba is supposed to be ha having a calling system coming out. I might get that too. Why not? Why not? Why not get it? So we have that. Um, let's let's clear this out. So we will just hit, I hold the clear button. So I just hold down the clear button and then I go to each one and click the right arrow or I click the, um, I, I navigate to it, hit the center button and it clears one by one. I'm not sure if you can clear them all out. Now, I haven't read the manual, so that's how easy it is pretty much to get right off the back. Um, do I want to? Let me, let's, uh, let's, I, I downloaded the Bubba app when I knew that it was on its way. And then I was like, I want to be ahead of the game a little bit. So here's the Bubba app. Now, oh, I have to, okay, let me enable where is it at? Let me enable Bluetooth. So 
So let me see, add device, connect to device. Hold on, let me, uh, my son just texted me and said, are you still recording? I think he's going to work. Hold on, we're gonna pause this and come back because I gotta go say bye to him, tell him to be careful. All right, we're back. So I enabled it. Let me go to my devices. Okay, are you sure you want to connect to this device to your account? Add. Okay, activate. Um, the Bubba SF comes with two free year subscription. Activate, why not? Activation complete, okay. Activate, okay. So, there we go, connect it. All right, let's go back to home. So it shows it's connected. It shows it's connected on the Bubba device. And now, from what I heard, is that if you weigh a fish, it will mark on here. So let's, 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 let's weigh a fish and see. We'll go here, lock, okay? Let's go to one, it's in there. Holy crap, that was quick. <laughs> that went on there fast. That was like real time right next to it. That was crazy. And that's what I have. Nice. Wow. That's pretty cool. So I'm not going to click map because I think it's going to show where I live. I don't want to do that. So that is pretty cool. Tournaments, no tournaments yet. Logbook. I have no logbook. Awesome. So that's pretty cool. So if I go to settings, check for updates for firmware, I'll probably check that in a minute. It tells me my battery's at 85%. I could change right there, tournament, rally, competition. I could change it on here, actually. Um, brightness, you could change the brightness. You could change the auto lock. You can change the lithium battery. You can change the sleep timer, clear the data, bag limit. You could pretty much do everything on here on the app. But other than that, that's cool. So, the color scheme, it's super easy. Super easy to, um, to do. Uh, I'm gonna switch this up. Should I do it now? Can I, let's do it now. Why not? Here we go. Easy does it. There's the hook. The hook is off. And, oh wait, let me cover my eye. That's the hook that it comes with solid hook and now we'll switch it to that one so since that's like that I will to clear it all you hit is clear to zero it out and then you're good there you go I might yeah that's cool there it is guys that is the Bubba scale pro series that I think is gonna be switching the game up. Now, it is a hefty price point. You're looking at um, $200 for this thing, $199. So if you're a tournament angler, I think it'll be good. For me, like I said, I got it because I geek out on this tech stuff. It's Bluetooth, it's cool, all that stuff. Um, it'll save me time because it even will tell you is the fact that when you're in tournament mode and you have a full coal or full bag, and you do catch another fish and you're gonna cull one, you would get it. And then once it locks, it lets you know this, which one is the one that you're supposed to cull out. If you switch it to a different one, it'll be red. See it turn green, then red. And if you do click it still, it'll give you a warning. Are you, are you trying to cull, or it says you are trying to cull a larger fish. This will reduce your bag weight. So that is cool. So if you call out a bigger fish, it's completely your fault. <laughs> but that's awesome, another feature. That's the Bubba scale, guys. This thing is ridiculous. But like I said, it does come with a hefty price point. But me personally, I like it. 
especially it being waterproof when you have other scales out there that are pretty high priced and not waterproof at all. My main thing is getting this thing. It has the coal system on there already. You don't have to um, mess with anything else. I do have another coal system, but this one right here, I think is going to save us some time. So some people might think you're crazy for getting it, but I like it. I like it. It looks like it's going to be, um, it looks, feel, feels built really well. Um, nice, sturdy. There's, it's, only thing I can say is this screen is, it's, it's, you can hear it, it's plasticky. So it's almost like the touch screen on the Rapala, Rapala, whatever. Um, so I wish they would have made it maybe like a hard plastic since it's not touch screen. But other than that, that's the only con I could probably have about it is that that screen is not well maybe there's glass underneath it i don't know but you can feel that plastic um but other than that only thing i can think of that might happen over time is these buttons right here um you know they have that plastic over it that over a long period of time they might start wearing out you know and start ripping a little bit after wear and tear but other than that, this thing is built nice. I mean, the uh, love that it's waterproof, love the brightness, love the coloring. I mean, there's nothing out there like this right now. So when it comes in stock, if you really want it, you better jump on it quick. You know, and I'm not saying that to go out and get it because they are pricey, but I just had to have it. So. But all right, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I thought I, I wanted to make it way better, but I wanted to get this video out there quick. Um, we'll do on the water reviews with it later on after I tested it out and see if I had any issues with it. But I think it's going to be a, a, a winner. So until then, guys, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. We will probably be out on the, I don't know where we're going next, but we'll see. But thanks, guys. I appreciate it. See you on the next one. Peace.